Hello everybody, this is Epicol64 and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door for the Nintendo GameCube. In the last episode, we started a chapter one post game, we got a couple extra things, and we started doing the Trouble Center, or doing troubles for the Trouble Center. And this episode, we are going to continue on with the chapter one post game and do some more troubles. And then we'll probably collect any star pieces and badges that we can get for right now. Anyway, the next trouble we're going to be doing is for Gunther. Find this guy. Hey, 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 hey! My name is Gunther. Or Gunther. My bad. Uh... <sighs> I'm not gonna say what that reference was. Please find that guy... Please find the guy that pulled off credit... That pulled off credit card fraud on me. I'll be in Rogueport Plaza, so come talk to me! Want to take on Gunther's trouble? Yes. I said Gunther instead of Gunther. If you guys know what reference I'm talking about, then you know it's from a really bad... TV channel. Uh, I'm not going to say what it is. I'm just going to let you guys figure it out. Anyway, let's talk to this guy. This is Gunther, I believe. Hey, you're here to handle my trouble, aren't you? Then listen up. Larson the Bandit pulled some credit card fraud on me and took my dough. I want to rub him up for it, but the guy is too wise and I can never catch him. He's hiding somewhere in Roport, so I want you to find him. By the way, bandits are those guys in blue outfits who wear masks. There are several in Roport, but this one will fess up once you grill him. Do this, and then you'll get your reward. I'm counting on you. Okay, so the first bandit we probably want to check who it is is probably the one that is on the east side of Roport, because there was a bandit on the east side. And then there was another one on the back, and then there's the one on the west side. Probably this guy. Hey, this area is the Turp of Ishnail and the Rubo and the Rubu band of thieves. Robo. I don't know what brings you here, but if you think you're gonna meet the boss, ha! So it's not that guy. So it's someone else, and I'm an idiot. Why did I do that? Don't be too reckless, or else you will lose health. So don't be too reckless. Uh okay. Was it the bandit in the back? Because there was a bandit earlier that we saw in the back that stole our money. So it may be that guy. If it is, we're going to go check right now. Right here. You got some kind of problem? You think you can just barge into my hideout, buddy? You're probably just jealous. No one snooping around. It's the perfect hideout spot. Camera? No. Okay, so that's not it. I can't remember what specific, uh, what specific bandit it was. Um, uh, I'm trying to remember. Uh, it's been a while since I've actually done these troubles, so I really don't remember what it was or which bandit it was. Maybe it's here? Here? Excuse me. Um, Nope, it can't be here. Okay, guys, I'm gonna do some off-screening just to find out what this guy is, and I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. Uh, there was an entire part that I actually decided to cut out because I don't think I was actually supposed to show that yet because it was sort of spoilers. So, yeah. Or maybe it wasn't. I really don't know if I'm gonna cut. I really don't know how I'm gonna do the cutting for this video. Um, oh, is it in the end? Is it in the end? It's in the end, isn't it? It's in the end. Oh, don't want to go over there yet. Is it... Or is it like... I... Ah! Where's that freaking bandit? I didn't realize this was going to be so freaking hard. Dang. Back here? No? Where's the bandit? Where's the freaking bandit? Bandit, where are you? Okay, I have no idea where the bandit is. I have no idea. Is it this guy? Or... No. Um... I don't know where they are. Um, wait a minute. Um... Hang on. Uh, could it be... Aha! You got a problem? What are you looking at? Unless you got busy with me, scram! 
What? You want me to turn money? I swindled. What are you? The fraud police? Sheesh. How did I let myself get caught? Where'd he go? He didn't even give it to us. Did he give it to us? Or was it just the money? Uh, I'm not so sure. But let's find out. Hey, hey, hey! Did you find Larson? The guy's on the verge of giving himself up, so don't worry about what he'll do. Just keep after him until you catch him. By the way, bandits are those guys are... Oh, man. Oh, we have to catch him! That jerk! Dang. You gotta be kidding me. Are you serious? Do I actually have to go try and catch him? Or is he gonna stay... <sighs> I hate bandits so much. I hate bandits so much. Bandits. Just the hatred. The hatred in my heart. This is ridiculous. I hate this trouble. No? Is he back here? Makes me wonder. Is he back here? Is he back here? Is he back here? Please tell me he's back here. Dang it! Uh, where is he? Uh, I really came unprepared. I should have looked up the troubles first. That was kind of dumb of me. Where is he? I just sound like Muscle Man from Regular Show. That was weird. And yes, I have seen Regular Show, and it actually is a pretty interesting show. It's pretty interesting. No? Uh... I already checked there. I'm stupid. Where'd he go? I don't remember where he went. I hate this. <laughs> I hate this. What is- There he is! Jeez! Chris, the fraud police! You don't give up easy, do you? You can't make me pay! Get back here, you jerk. Wow, he's fast! Where'd he go? <laughs> this guy is gonna drive me insane. I swear. I hate this. So much. I hate this. Where is he? Where'd he go? Did he go behind? I don't know! I really came in this unprepared. That was the one thing I didn't get prepared for this episode. <laughs> or prepared for. There he is! Chris, you properties! Heck, please! Shoot, you're serious! <laughs> Fine, I'm a man! Do with me as you will. Oh, he's Gunther. Hey, 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 hey! Looks like you caught him! Nice! Here's your reward! 20 coins. So, since it looks like you're all out of dough, I'll take it out of your hide. Eek! No, please! Um. Derp. <laughs> I have no idea what he was just doing. Alright, so now that we finally got that trouble done, that was annoying. That was seriously annoying. I didn't realize how annoying that trouble was. Since I don't really think I never did that trouble because I didn't bother to do that trouble last week because I didn't want to do that trouble because I never did that trouble! I think I've gotten, I think I lost a little bit of insanity. <laughs> Screw you, bandits! Screw you! Alright. Let's do enough trouble. Mouse a million. Hit me, please. Mouse a million. Here. I need some help jogging my memory. Meet me in Rogueport Square in front of the shop. Want to take on Mouse a million's trouble? Yes, please. That's a mouthful. That mouth is a total mouthful. Alright, so now we want to head off to Rockport Square, and you know that uh, purple mouse that was in Rockport Square that we saw earlier? That's the guy that we probably want to hit the hit, or jog his memory with. How do we do it? You'll find out in just a little bit. Should be around here. Should be in front of the shop. There he is. Sniff, sniff, sniff. You accepted my trouble. I smell it. Thank you. I found a good lid on a way, on a way to make money, but I sort of forgot about it. So I want to you so I want to use shock treatment to try to remember it. Yes, indeed. Just keep hitting me on the head with that hammer until I remember. But be careful. If you hit me after I remember it, I'll forget again. Okay? Let's do this. I just can't remember. I just can't remember. 
I just can't remember. I just can't remember. I just can't remember. Come on! Buddy! Remember! Remember, please! Come on! Game! There we go. That's it! I remember now! I have to buy a sleepy sheep at the shop in Roadport. And sell it for a two-coin profit in Petalburg. <laughs> I'll let that tip be your reward. Don't spend all those profits. This sh you solved the trouble. I'll let the tip be for your reward. Come on, game! He didn't even give us anything. Really? He didn't give us anything. That's a tippy war reward. You suck. We didn't even get anything out of that. Or did we? No, we didn't. We didn't get anything out of that trouble. That sucks. That was a dumb trouble. Anyway, Bomberto. I'm hungry. This is Bomberto, and, and I need you to do some shopping. Please come right quick, because I'm starving. Meet me in Rogue Corps, out in, at the docks. Want to take on Bomberto's trouble? Do it and do it right. Okay. So yes, we're basically yeah. I think these I think this post game is gonna be three parter. Sorry about that, guys. I didn't expect it to be this long or something. I didn't really expect it to be that long. Really apologize for that, but that's what I get for actually doing a walkthrough for this game, sort of walkthrough-ish thing for this game. Even though I'm not that good of one. <laughs> anyway, this Bomberto. Uh, that's not it. Uh, that's not it. Where did he say to meet me? Oh, wait a minute. Bomberto. My foot is falling freaking asleep! What was it again? I can't remember. I really need to learn to pay attention! Okay, that must be him. Huh? Oh, oh, yeah, right, right, right. You took all my trouble, eh? My wife brought my lunchbox to me, but it was empty when I opened it. I'm so hungry, I could eat wal walrus whiskers. Ugh, that's gross. You gotta bring me something to eat. How about a let me sing? Ah, uh, whatever, anything, so as long as it's food. Now go get it. Um, let's give him the sh let's give him the shrimp fry. Hey, that looks right tasty. Chomp, no, no, no. Yum, that hits the spot. Now here's your reward. 11 coins. That was really easy. That was easy. <laughs> Shameless commercial reference. Seriously, that meme, that was, that, that saying that was easy has sort of been becoming a meme on the internet because a lot of people tend to reference it now. Anyway, uh, let's go ahead and do another trouble. I think we're probably going to do all the troubles in this episode, and then next episode we'll cover anything uh, else we need to cover. And then in next episode, we'll probably also find the next location for the Crystal Star as well. At least I believe that's what's going to happen. It's really dark in my room right now. The line in, my, in this uh, part of the room is actually broken, so I'm actually in a, It's really dark down here. Koop Pook. Try to find me. It's me, Koop Pook, the wandering hide and seek champion. I'm hiding somewhere in Hooktail Castle right now. Hiding like you read about it. If you find me, I'll give you something good. Think you can do it? Really? Want to take on Coop Ook's trouble? Yes, I do. Do it and do it right. Okay. So because it's Act Hooktail's Castle, I am going to off-screen to Hooktail's Castle because you guys already know how to get there. So, commence huge off-screening! Uh -oh. All right, guys, we are back. So now that we're at Hooktail's Castle, because we haven't made the Hooktail's Castle in a while, I might as well show you guys how to get there. And I'm going to speed up the video. So, um, do you mean to press that button? I keep mixing up X and Y. Okay, that's Y here. We're going to head back across. All right, and with that, I think I'm going to go ahead. Instead of off screen, I'm going to speed up the video because I feel I need to show you guys where this uh, Koopook is. So... Without further ado, speed up the video with awesome music!
so we are finally back. So Kubuk is actually in this room. So what you want to do here is you want to go on this green switch. And what you want to do is jump at the right time. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. There he is! So just head down here. Blast! So, you found me. Curses. I felt sure that none would ever find me here. I'm a master, you see. I love sneaking and hiding so much. I just never stop. It was a hobby, but I kept hiding, and soon I was known as the Hide and Seek Koopa. Koopook! I thought it was you. We used to be neighbors back when we were barely shell high. Koops? Is that you? Wait, they're friends? Yes, Koops! The same Koops who always had to be it when we played hide and seek. But you never found me. Not even once. I can't believe you finally did it. Yeah, I remember back then. That one day, you hid and no one ever found you. Right, that was the very day I decided to become the hide and seek Koopa. Ever since that day, I've hid and snuck and snuck and hid my way through life. Holy crap, that is epic. Yep, that was a crazy day. I think Koops is still trying to process that. But, since you found me this time, I'll give you a reward, like I promised. And it's a very special reward! You got a special card! A parlor card that lets you play the plane mode game. Interesting. I found this while I was traveling, and hiding around the world. I don't need it. Well, I'm off. Time to go look for a new hiding place. Wish me luck. I guess I've still got a lot to learn about hiding if you found me, Koops. It was nice seeing you again, though. See you later. He just jumped off a cliff. That's epic. <laughs> he hid his entire life. That's awesome. Anyway, uh, slim through here, and we get a live stream. Pretty interesting. Okay, so now we have finished that trouble. I'm gonna go ahead and off-screen all the way back to... Rogue Ports. So I'm gonna do this battle first, and I'm gonna off-screen back to Rogue Ports. So I will see you guys in a bit. Okay, guys, I am finally back. So, uh, hold on, I'll back. I'm gonna go check the time. Okay, guys, I'm back. Uh, I've been recording for 25 minutes, but because I've done so much cutting in this video, I'm gonna keep going because, well, a ton of cutting makes for a short video. So, yeah. So let's go ahead and do another trouble. In fact, I think I'm gonna go ahead and finish up the troubles in this episode, even though it's, it's gonna make the episode maybe a little bit longer. Mayor Croops. Will someone please come talk to me, please? I'm waiting at the pink house in Petalburg. Want to take on Mayor Croup's trouble? Yes, please. Do it and do it right. Alright, guys, so I'm gonna off screen. Uh, Croup's, you may remember, is the mayor of Petalburg. So I'm gonna off screen to Petalburg since you guys already know what that is. And I'll be right back. Commence epic cut. Or maybe it's not that epic, but anyway, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I am finally back. Now that we actually made it here to Petalburg, what we wanna do is head over to. Croup's house, which you remember is the pink house in Puddleburg. The very ugly pink house. And we want to head up here, and here it is. So, let's talk to him. Well, well, Murphy. You must have got some of my requests. Good, good. Truth to be told, I've been a touchy, uh, touch lonely here with no one to talk to. Since you came here, why don't you relax with me for a bit? Indulge in old Koopa. Oh, to tell you the truth, I've got a few things to say about kids these days. Their tempers are too short for their own good, for one. It makes me want to smack them. Why, I was shopping at the Toadstool Bros Discount Super Shop the other day. I was trying to pay, and my coin purse was stuck closed, and the kid behind me said, Hey, geezer, wanna pay so we can get out of here before the sun goes down? Now, I may be a geezer, but the sundown was clearly taking longer than I was, clearly. Speaking of the sundown, reminds me of dating the missus back before she was the missus. Always having her home by sundown, yes sir. I was an absolute maniac. Yep, I keep my eyes on the sun and off the missus, gently. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, she was sort of, uh, kind of lying in, in a painful sore way. 
Uh, just think about it makes me feel awkward. Uh, is memory grand? Uh, but that's not what I'm talking about. Now, where was I? Hmm. Oh, that's right. Kids today. They ain't. Yeah. I want to stand up to yell, hey, you fuck stream. Okay. I know! Uh, speaking of which, I was thinking I proclaim my love for Mrs. Yep. She was leaving on a train and I yelled it from, yelled it from the platform, like in a movie. Now, what was that? I yelled to her something about her shell, maybe. Oh, wait, I think it's Trey from my main point again. Or, wait, serious. No! Sorry. Uh, I'm still on the point. Uh, no, wait, my point was something about kids today. Ah, uh, whatever. Oh, my nuclear swim! <sighs> Sorry, I had to listen. Oh, um, yeah, I'm, I'm still listening. <laughs> I'm just happy to get a little FaceTime with the youth today. <laughs> and Mario just wakes up. Oh, I forgot to set the tea. Aren't I, aren't I an old ninny? My apologies. In fact, I haven't even added the hot water part. Awfully sorry. Turk, you got the turtley leaf. A leaf found in Petalburg. Replenishes 3 FP. Blah, 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 you suck. No wonder no one wants to talk to him. Anyway, guys, even though I did say we we're going to finish all the troubles in this episode, I think I'm going to go ahead and end it off because we've gone off for like... 30 minutes, and I need to end it. So if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys next episode for more Paper Mario Thoughts on your door. This is Epic Cooking Force, signing out. <sighs>